Hello you guys and welcome back to my vlog. I am going to Whole Foods right now. Oh my god, I could tell my husband's so I'm in the car. My feet don't even touch the pedal. Uh, so I'm going to Whole Foods right now to pick up a few pizzas. So I went to Target yesterday and I got him these house slippers and they didn't even fit in his foot. So I have to return those. And then, um, yeah. I think that's all I have to do today. It's currently 12.04 and it's Sunday, October 29th. I finished cleaning my house already. I'm putting it in reverse as if I'm going right now for my navigation. I finished cleaning my house today already. So I'm done with the house and just going to have a relaxing Sunday. So yeah hold on i need lotion my hands are so dry right now it's so crazy windy today that our 12 foot skeleton that was in front of our house completely fell over and yeah so my husband just assembled it put it all in our garage so yeah it's so crazy windy today and I'm getting really distracted. <laughs> my ADHD is not letting me focus on just filming this intro. So that was it for my intro. Hello, enjoy the vlog. Make sure you subscribe and like this video and I'll see you in a second. I am doing my makeup as you can kind of see it is Halloween today so happy Halloween it's currently 625 and my husband and I plan on going to Six Flags for Halloween so I don't have a costume so I just thought I would do a little bit of like angelic makeup or maybe not a, I don't know I don't know what I'm supposed to be but I'm just putting on some eyeshadow just because, you know, it's Halloween, why not? So I'm just putting on this light pastel blue eyeshadow and yeah, I just wanted to say hello, happy Halloween. I want to know what you guys are doing, so make sure you definitely comment what you did for Halloween, what you dressed up as. <laughs> This I got from Target, I believe, over almost two years ago. I wore this all throughout nursing school because we were only allowed to wear white, jack like white jackets to school and clinicals. So this is the one I always wore through nursing school because I was always cold. I love this. And then my pants, they are, you can't see, can you? My pants are, I don't know what brand they are, let me check. 
my pants my pants are airy i got them from marshall's or it was burlington i believe and they're so comfy and cute and these are my shoes of the day i don't have many sneakers so i was actually really happy these shoes match with my outfit these are from adidas i got these a while ago they are really comfy they're just completely flat shoes love them so this is the oott OOTD, not OOTT. And then this headband I got from the dollar store. So that's the whole outfit. I'll show you guys when I'm by the elevators. You will be seeing a lot of my outfits by the elevators, but I can't really talk because people walk by. I'll see you in a sec. Bye. What do you guys think of these glasses? I feel like it's to 2013 Kanye West, so. I could literally see my eyelashes. I don't know if you can see. So, pass. Hello, guys. So, I just got home, and me being the compulsive declutter, that's what it's called. I actually did Google it. Wait, I got. Oh, sorry. I just got a notification and got distracted. Um, I did Google it because I was like, I wonder what it's called when someone just constantly wants to get rid of everything, like anything that I feel like is bothering me, I wanna get rid of. So today it's my closet. I actually pick up my closet a lot. And especially since I've had some of these items for a little while, I outgrew it. So I want to donate, sell some of the stuff that I have. So I'm just going to be going through right now, picking and choosing what I want. Doesn't matter the brand, I don't care I don't, if I don't like it, if I'm not wearing it, if I haven't worn it, I'm getting rid of it. I really want to declutter all these clothes. Also, I just realized I'm wearing the same pajamas the last vlog. I promise this is washed. I smells nice, smells like laundry. I just happen to be wearing it right now as I'm vlogging uh so yeah let's clean the closet also if you see i'm only wearing the shirt but i do have shorts under i have shorts under but you just can't see that so it might look like i'm naked under but i'm not i have shorts so i'm rambling a lot again let's declutter this closet Hello, oh, it's crooked. Okay. Hello guys. So I just got home a little while ago. As you can see, it's starting to get dark because my camera, okay. It's starting to get a little dark. Oh my gosh. It's... I was thinking about it because I've always been this way since I was really young. I would throw so many things away and then my mom would be like, where is this thing? Where is that? And I've just always been this way. I googled it yesterday because I was curious what that's called and it's called compulsive decluttering and I really feel like I have that and I've had it since I was young I just never googled what the name was so yeah I all day I was thinking about like how I can't wait to come home and get rid of my clothes that's literally exactly what I did I stepped in the house I came to my office and threw my pajamas on and I was like it's time to clear like time to clear out these clothes so I cleared out some of my clothes um, because my style is evolving as you can see I have like a few Disney stuff those I will keep but I'm trying to start I'm, I want to start buying like more quality pieces so I would rather have less clothes, but it be with quality than more clothes and it be cheaper. So that's kind of what I want to start doing. There is still stuff that I have in my closet that's like more sentimental stuff. 
I haven't worn it for a while, so I'll still keep that, but I try to keep my clothes as minimal as possible. And this is, it might seem like a lot behind me, but this is my winter, it's my summer clothes, it's all there. And I really try to declutter as much as I can. I see all these cute outfits on TikTok and I'm just like, those are such cute outfits and that's so my style. Yet my wardrobe is like the complete opposite. So that's why I'm trying to get rid of some stuff and then slowly start introducing some like more quality pieces from the brands that I like. So I'm rambling. So now that I'm done with this, I'm going to go and wash the dishes. And whenever I wash the dishes, I have my iPad next to me and it's just such a fun time. Like I stand there, I look at the iPad, I have my headphones in and I wash the dishes and it just time goes by so fast. So let me know if you guys do that as well. If you like washing dishes, if you distract yourself with the iPad next to you. For tonight, we're gonna take the babies out for a walk. I don't know when we're gonna go, but what time is it? 6.09 and it's starting to get dark outside. Uh, so we have to go soon. And after we're done walking them, I told my husband, tonight I am craving in and out I never crave in and out but I saw this YouTube video of this girl. She was pregnant and she was eating um, I saw this YouTube video of this girl and she was eating animal style fries. She's like, I'm craving it so much. And she went and she got it and she just sat in the car and just started eating it like a mukbang. And I was like, oh my God, I want in and out animal style fries so bad. So hopefully I get it tonight. If I get it, I will obviously show you guys and hopefully continue the trend of <laughs> making you guys crave something. So yeah rambled on way too long i don't know how much of this i'm gonna end it out but i don't know i feel like we're chatting i just love when i vlog and just let everything out because personally me i love watching long vlogs so if you guys enjoy the long vlogs please let me know uh if not please let me know as well because again personally I love sitting down and watching 30 40 minute vlogs it it soothes me when I'm washing dishes when I'm cleaning the house and I just have it on the side I'm listening to it so I love it personally so let me know please I've been talking for five minutes already so hopefully the next clip you see will either be us at the park or animal style french fries yum I'm vlogging, just so you know, this is a normal thing now. I'm a vlogger now. Yeah, Look at Daisy. <laughs> Daisy? Daisy. No, I listen. Today, my in and out, I'm going all out. I am getting everything that I want. I got a cheeseburger with grilled onions, extra well done, sliced chilies, animal fries, and half vanilla, half strawberry shake. No, don't be a silly goose. That one's ours. Hi, good, thank you. Am I getting something for your order? Hi, can I please have five spreads? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, they gave it separately. Wait. I have a question. We asked for a large with them mixed together. Yeah. 
Okay, is this just only strawberry and this only vanilla? No, they mixed both of them. Oh, we only asked for one, that's why. Okay. Do you want me to clean this No, it's okay. Yeah, it's okay. Thank you. I don't know what ha I don't know. Maybe I ordered it wrong or something. Why are we gonna drink all of this? That's a lot. These are both the shakes. Sorry, we thought we were just getting one, and we asked for it to be mixed, but I guess the guy misunderstood. He seemed like he was new. No, babe, it's mixed. He got two instead of one. Oh. Remember okay. he, asked, he asked. So then he just he gave us got one more. I don't know if I got charged for it. I I think it's yeah, a receipt though. Yeah, yeah. Um, Oh, it's too thick. I can't drink it. No, 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 no. That's enough. It's way too thick. No, it's not. It's okay. Where did get out of here? Mmm. <laughs> oh, boy. good morning so right now i am going to get a pap smear done i don't know the last time i've gotten one probably over a few years ago i believe pap smears every three to five years i can't really remember exactly you know when they say uh, if you don't use it you lose it or something i knew all of that <laughs> during and after nursing school but when time goes on when you don't practice in that field you definitely forget all those little things so anyways today I decided to wear scrubs to work because when I finished nursing school I had a job at a sniff and it did not work out so and I, I was also on the field, like there was, um, I worked at a sniff, I worked at an aftercare, I worked a few places actually, and so I ended up finding an excuse to go shopping, so I bought a bunch of uniforms, and now they're in my drawer just sitting there, haven't touched it, haven't worn it in such a long time, so even though I am an office nurse now, I still want to wear my uniforms just because I did spend a lot of money on a different all the different types of uniforms that I bought so if you guys see me wearing scrubs and you don't know I am a nurse and yeah just wanted to say that filled my water bottle up to the very top so I know exactly in a day how much I'm drinking Ooh. But yeah, I'm going to my pap smear right now. And then afterwards, I have to make a quick stop at Trader Joe's because I didn't have time this morning to make lunch because there was dishes. And I keep taking my glasses off because I feel like weird talking when you guys can't see my eyes. But yeah, I didn't have time to make lunch today. So I'm going to go to Trader Joe's and pick up lunch and maybe a coffee because I don't know. I don't know how I slept last night, but I feel sleepy this morning. Or maybe it's because I've been up since 6 a.m. like cleaning the house. And when I say cleaning the house, the living room, upstairs, it's all clean. Like the kitchen is the only thing I actually have to clean in the house because we don't use plastic plates. We use dishes and all of that. So. Just doing like one simple thing requires like minimum two, three dishes. So they definitely pile up every day. Dishes are an everyday thing. But aside from that, no dishes. Uh, but aside from that, um, I don't have to clean the house every day. So yeah, I am a rambling. I will see you guys in a sec.
actually I don't want my door to lock so I'm just going to open it from here. Ah. Now. Okay. I had to open my driver's side door before I shut this one because my car loves to play this game with me where the key will literally it's in my backpack and it will just automatically lock and my keys are inside of the car and it'll lock and I have no way of literally getting it out so yeah that's happened to me before and it was horrible sorry I got cut off I don't know what was the last word it caught but I was saying um yeah I had to open this one because if I shut this passenger side door, then I probably would have been locked out and I don't have the app that allows me to unlock my phone. So that would have really stuck. So that would have really sucked um, if I got locked out of my car, so I had to lean over and open it. But anyways, I have to drive right now. I'm leaving work. my phone and that is exactly why I put you on this tripod and I'm sorry it's so low you guys like see half my face let me see if I could raise you I'll ask my husband to fix it because the steering wheel is directly right here and I would love if it wasn't so anyways I am leaving work right now going home my hair looks oily because I put on oil on my face this morning and it got all in the fronts of my hair so because it's oily even though it's not it's clean I'm going to go home and I'm going to put the rosemary oil in my hair because I have seen a few people use it and they say it's really helped the hair I have fine hair I have a lot of hair but it's fine and it's very frizzy at the bottoms too. I definitely need a trim. I was waiting for the wedding to pass so that I could trim my hair, but I don't have any shears, so I have to order them off of Amazon. Once I do, I'm going to trim my hair at least like two inches, maybe three. Uh, but yeah, I've been using the rosemary oil. I actually want to show you guys how my hair looks now so that I can check back in like six months and see if there has been a difference a lot of people say no but i don't know I'll, i'm just trying it out it doesn't hurt to to put it in my hair so i will chat with you guys in a sec because my mommy just called me and i want to chat with her on the way home so see you okay so i didn't want to get my tripod out so I have you in the mirror. It is Friday night. It's November 3rd. And we are going to have dinner, my husband and I. So I'm going to put some hair oil. That's better. I feel like there was too much back there. So we're going to have dinner and I'm going to put oil on my hair. I thought my hair wasn't oily, but turns out it is oily. So I'm going to wash it when I get back. And this is what I mean with, about my hair. It's fine, but I have a lot. Don't be fooled. Okay. So. This is the oil that I use. I was looking into buying it and then there was people, like a lot of reviews saying it doesn't work, it doesn't work. So I ended up not getting it. And I didn't end up doing anything with my hair. I didn't look into other oils or anything. And then one day I was at my sister's house and she was like, hey, I have a little bald spot right there. I, I've always had it. So I'm just putting it there to see if anything grows. 
um, one day I was at my sister's house and she was like, hey, I have this hair oil. Like, if you want it, I don't really use it. So I ended up taking it. This is my third time um, putting this oil in my hair. And just so we have a before and after, this is what it looks like. You can see it's really fine. I have thin pieces here. I definitely feel like this is this side is um this side of my face has less hair. This side of my head has less hair. This one's more full. Like if I run my fingers through it, it's pretty full, but this side you can see some gaps. Wait, I could put the lighting up, I'm sorry. And I like this. so weird I also put it at the nape of my neck I just worked it all the way through I don't put it on my ends I did the last time and I didn't really see a difference but I don't put it on my ends because it's already dry and I'm gonna trim it off soon I'm pretty sure okay enough of this I am going to part it down the middle. Okay. For a bristle brush, this one is from Swissco. And Honestly, I could just pass as this being hair gel, just like really shiny. I just realized how long my hair is. In a ponytail, it's super long. Crazy. Where did I put this on? Mm, let's put that there for now. Okay. I want to show you guys what it looks like. Definitely really shiny, especially compared to the other half of my hair. But yeah, that's kind of how it looks. Let's put this up more. Cute. Okay, let's go. Excuse. Oh, flash. Excuse the mess. We are currently cleaning our office, and I have some laundry to put away. But this is my outfit. I got this cropped hoodie from Shein. This was, I don't know, maybe like Marshalls or something. I think these were Burlington. These have to be one of my favorite pairs of high-waisted sweatpants. And then bag is Louis Vuitton. I got this as a wedding gift from my in-laws. That is the fit, y'all. I'm also gonna pair it with white Crocs. Just, you know, white up here, white down there. So, yeah, let's go. Bye.
Hello you guys, good morning. Today is Saturday, November 4th. I was gonna say October 4th. I actually slept in, which was so nice. I woke up at like 8.20 and I got in the shower and I am taking down the Halloween decorations. Finally, four days feels a little too late. <laughs> but I've been a little busy the past few days. Right now, I want to just trim a little bit off the ends of my hair. I believe I mentioned it yesterday, but I don't have any cutting shears. So I'm gonna use these like little scissors that I have and just trim the bottom very little. Or should I just wait? I don't know. Should I just wait? I'll just say, you know what, I'm not gonna cut my hair. Um, but if you hear that noise in the background, my husband is working on our master bathroom. It also, so the master bathroom and this bathroom are original to when the house was made, which was, I believe, in 1996. So the bathroom hasn't been renovated since then. And so we are slowly just like starting to break down the countertops and then eventually we will start, you know, making our dream bathroom. I actually think I'm gonna put a little bit of oil in my hair. I'm gonna use the Trader Joe's Shea Butter and Coconut Oil Hair Serum because I tend to have very frizzy hair. Let's put this on the bottoms. So the agenda for today is I am going to be taking down the decorations, cleaning up the house. Um, and then I plan on going to visit my mother-in-law today so that she can teach me how to cook. I know how to do like basic things, but to be like, Oh, I know how to make a traditional Armenian dish or a soup or something like that. No, my mother-in-law is really um, savvy in that way. She knows how to bake cakes, macaroons. Um, she loves to bake bread. She is the trade of all trades, as they say. She knows how to do so much and like even make yogurt. I ate her yogurt that she made the other day and it was better than the store-bought ones that I eat. So that's the plan. I brushed my hair after showering, so I hope it'll kind of stay straight. So it's not so frizzy. Um, and yeah, I will take you guys with me throughout the day so we can clean together. I hope you guys enjoy. I hope I'm in frame, by the way. I hope my face isn't cut off or something. If it is, I'm so sorry if it's bugging you. But um, I'm going to, you know, little by little clean up the decorations up here. And then the kitchen, you know, a tornado came and hit it last night. Because that's when me and my husband love to just sit down, watch TV, and make dinner. And... It's left a mess overnight, so I'm gonna go and clean that. Um, the kitchen needs a lot of cleaning. And yeah, let's get our Saturday morning started. I will see you guys in a sec. sister got this for me as a little present before I got married and I guess it's supposed to represent me and my two other sisters so I thought it was so cute my sisters love Halloween just as much as I do maybe not as much but they definitely do love Halloween so I already have some dishes that I have washed need to put those away 
And then it's just kind of like decluttering all of the stuff off of the countertops. And the dishes, there aren't many actually. So yeah. I just wanted to show you guys what my wedding flowers look like a whole month later. You can tell they're really crispy and crunchy. I don't know if I'm going to keep it though, honestly. I feel like it's just too messy and this is already like discolored. So I think I might throw it away. I don't know. I think I might just toss them actually. I want to show my lunch. It's just avocado, salt, pepper. This one is everything but the bagel seasoning. Is that a seed? Just toss that in there. Um, I just cleaned the countertops and the floor. It's so messy. But um, this one is the same salt, pepper, except it's cayenne. And then these lemons are from my mother-in-law's tree. So this is the quick little lunch that I'm gonna eat before I start cleaning again. Hello you guys. Good morning, today is Sunday, I believe the 6th, November 6th. And it's quite warm today. So I just have the air on in the car. I'm sorry if you hear it. Uh, I am going to take care of my husband's grandma for a little bit because my mother-in-law and the woman that takes care of her are both going places so I'm going to just hang out with her a little bit. But before I go I just wanted to grab myself one of the new Starbucks drinks. I know in one vlog I said I don't like Starbucks drinks and I don't. I prefer just like grinding my own coffee and just drinking it black. So this is kind of like a dessert for me. I just made breakfast for my husband and I. I made eggs, bacon, sausage, uh, cheese, and on the eggs, I melted cheese. So, and by cheese, I meant like Armenian cheese. It's like a round loaf of cheese. The eggs, cheese, and the other cheese are different. Um, anyways, I'm rambling, but I wanted to pick up a dessert, which is going to be the uh, Christmas drink. I don't know which one to get, but luckily my sister loves Starbucks, so she texted me the one that she likes. So that's what I'm going to get. You can see my eyes. I slept with this eye makeup, so don't judge if it's crusty. I know it is. The light eyes, you got anyone else? Um, can I please have it the largest size? Of course. Not the Trent I believe. It does not have one the Trent I Okay, yeah, just the largest size, please. Okay, what else? That was it, please. Thank you. Hello guys. I am heading home right now. I stopped by so many stores today with no luck on finding a dress for the bridal shower I'm going to be going to this month. Um, I honestly think I'm just going to become an online shopper, which I've never been an online shopper before. I rarely ever order anything online i honestly don't even use amazon so i think i'm getting to the point where going in store it just 
it always disappoints me and I, I feel disappointed every time I go into a, a Marshalls, a TJ Maxx, I don't know, I don't, I can't find anything nice in those stores. Um, so yeah, that was kind of annoying. I went to three different stores to find a dress, found nothing. 